Hey gang, it's Ark. And this is our interloper mapping challenge in the long dark. I'm going to step right back outside here. There's some rabbits out here. And I think I can go ahead and get them, even though I'm not able to run right now. Um, I want to go ahead and get them so I can harvest them tonight. Actually, they may be... Oh, there's some over there on the hillside. I wonder if I'm... Oh yeah, I'm significantly over capacity, which is also making me slower. Alright, maybe he'll wander back over this way. I'm gonna go drop off a bunch of gear, and then um, maybe I'll be able to move quickly enough. I think the wind was also slowing me down. I could spend an hour sleeping and get some energy back that way, but I don't want to spend that much time. get rid of some water definitely don't need to be carrying two hacksaws drop the cooking pot for right now the storm lantern this is just um, temporarily and I'm not gonna carry around this archery book Um, or the cooking book. I think I'll just keep one book on me, in case I need to read. I also don't need this scrap metal right now. Alright, we didn't really lose a lot of weight yet. We have so many torches. Alright, let me put some fuel in this drawer. And I'll just have to remember to come back and grab some of that. Okay, we're able to move quite a bit quicker now. This should be enough to uh, go ahead and get done what I want to get done out here. It's a lot nicer out here now. Of course, now I might not even be able to find the rabbits. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and grab all of these. I can leave these to cure in the, um in the house here. Probably going to be a long time before I need these. Yeah, whatever uh, rabbits were up here, it looks like they've moved on for now. There's one, I think. coming towards me. I'll try to let him get pretty close. It's uh, less likely that I'll miss that way. Of course, I still managed to overthrow. Um, and I also need to be close enough to get to him before he recovers. 
Uh, which is a little bit harder since I can't run right now. I'd really like to get another one. Seems like there's usually um, two of them around when they're in a spot, but I don't know exactly what the conditions are. There's still a bit of light. Maybe I'll step inside and harvest this one. And then I can uh, come back out and see if there's another one out here. So tomorrow, I want to briefly step out sort of in that direction over there and see if I can find all the sticks that I dropped um, in a panic last episode. And there's also a deer there. All right, let's get this guy dropped next to the window here. Um... And I need to make a note real quick that there's birch saplings curing here. Okay. Um... Guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. And let's just um drop that meat there. I did look up the hot uh, the hot key for that. In between episodes. All right. There's one more rabbit out here. Alright, maybe something happened to the other one. Or I already got one and forgot about it. It's possible that I hunted one when I was here. I think it was two episodes ago. Possibly three. It's uh, nice and late. We'll be able to get the sleep that we need. And there will be plenty of light when it's time to set out. And I'll probably um, cook the meat up in the morning. Actually go into the inventory here to eat, be a little quicker. I'm not going to eat too much right now. I just need enough to get me through the night with a little bit of leeway. Okay, where is the bed in here? Should have uh, located that first. I 
I mean, there is a bed, right? Okay, I'm feeling um, a little ridiculous right now. Let's get my... Oh, I dropped my lantern on the ground. Perfect. All right, there's a wood stove here. Chair, bench, here's the bed. Found it. Okay, it's still quite dark, but we can just go ahead and get some more sleep. That's all of our water, but we have more that we dropped. So let's get another couple hours. I want to be as rested as possible when we set out. I'm going to take the lantern with us. Um, actually, we're going to need that water. And I want to just set some of this stuff up here so that I know where it is. The hacksaw I definitely don't need. I already have one. And I guess that's everything. Now I should probably note... In my journal that I have three skill books here as well. Okay, let's step outside and see what the weather's like. A little snowy, but definitely not bad. Don't see any predators. I won't be able to start a fire with my magnifying lens. But that's not the end of the world. Okay, let's go see if we can find... Is that a birch bark on the ground? Yes, it is. I'll take that. Let's go see if we can find the deer and all of those sticks that I dropped. And there's the cave that we'll weave through probably later today. More rabbits in the clearing over here. Um, I'll just keep that in mind for the next time I'm over this way. Oh, I'm starving. Okay, that is a wolf. I don't see any sign of that tree fall where the deer was. So I'm going to go around this way. Let's take a pot shot here. Oh, he stopped moving. Like a grab it. gonna drop him. He'll be there when we come back. Oh, we're already fully cold. I wasn't thinking about the temperature. 
If I don't locate this soon, I think we're just going to move on. Visibility is fairly poor right now. The further I go, the more I risk not being able to find my way back. Well, there's the hut. Maybe there's more than one of those little sheds. I'm going to crest this hill and look around me. I'm hearing noises around me. Wolves generally don't climb up high, though, from what I've seen. That could be it there. Nah, that's just a rock. Yeah, somewhere around here there's a fallen tree with a bunch of sticks and a uh, deer nearby, but I don't see it. Alright, let's see if we can get off of this slope and we'll just head back. Move this over here closer to where I want to be. Good thing I know which way we're going. Did that get teleported all the way back there because I misclicked? Hmm. Alright, forget this. that other rabbit so bad. I'm just going to go back and grab it. There's no chance I'll get lost and uh, lose my life here, right? There's the rabbit. Now, I'm going to go this way. And my hunger is also really low, so I need to keep an eye on that. The reason I wanted to go ahead and get the meat now is because we're going to be stuck inside for a bit, so at least I'll have something to do. I'll harvest these, I'll cook them up. If I still have time, I might even leave the um, skins around. Alright, let's verify that I am where I think I am. There should be a shed here. Perfect. So if I head in this direction, I'll find the homestead again. I think I might have to go around there, but I'm just going to head up this way. I'm watching my hunger meter. Okay, there it is. I made it. Um, I think I can get inside and then eat. Don't mess me up here. Food eats. As long as I finish eating... Oh, it's already... Alright, so we made it as far as that's concerned. And now we've just got to wait out this blizzard. It's still fairly early in the day, so... Uh, we should still be able to leave for Mountain Town. I 
Okay, let's get a few more calories in me just to make sure I don't mess this up. So with the hacksaw, this takes 22 minutes. By hand, it takes 45 minutes. All right, I guess I'll use a hacksaw. Seems, yeah, that's way more efficient. single one of my books in here. Well, let's just grab a couple of those. Okay, torch, um, cattail head, book. Well, this got off to a much slower start than I had originally thought, but it's okay. We're going to get some extra calories here get some things done. And, uh, hopefully oh, yeah. we'll be That's a good one. in a good position after this. We'll just add a few more sticks to this real quick. Okay, only five minutes on that little piece. We're gonna need to make a bunch of water as well. about 30 minutes to burn here. I wanted to do some crafting. We have birch bark. Let's do all three of those. not to waste too much time just waiting for stuff to happen, uh, but we might end up in that position regardless. So we've got just a few minutes here, I don't think there's anything I can do with that whole amount of time. minutes on each of those. I need to keep the fire going. Uh, I'm actually going to run out of fuel here. I kind of wish I had found those sticks now. Get these last two pieces of rabbit on here, or maybe it's only the one. That uh, seems to be it. Let's go ahead and make my birch bark tea. Mm, 
nine minutes on that. We should be able to do a little bit of crafting. Let's make a pair of rose hips. Another nine minutes. Just make another rose hip tea. Ow, we actually need water. Well, let's just go ahead and make a full amount. Have just enough time left on the fire for that. Um, once I get the other water going on here, I'll probably run outside real quick and try to gather some sticks in the blizzard. Any remaining time here, I'll probably just uh, try to get organized with my materials. I can harvest some of the additional parts from the rabbits if I still have time to kill. items in here I could break down to. Break that down in half an hour. Let's go see what's outside first. I'm going to stay very close to the house. I do not want to get lost in this. I'll just head a little bit up the hill here. There's some trees around here. Look like it's uh, blown any sticks down, man. Alright, let's just get back inside. I could go over there, but that's a bit further away, and... <laughs> it's not like I really need the fuel right now. Let me make a note in my journal. That's, um, that's just to remind me when we come back here that I need to look for that. Did that save? Yeah, okay. Alright, I do want a little bit of extra fuel, so let's do this half hour one. That's nice. Um, how am I doing for water? I have almost none. And as far as carry weight, I'm well within what I like. These will take an hour to finish. So I'm going to add that. I think I'm going to get one hour of sleep while these are finishing. Okay, let's collect these. I'm gonna leave the cooking pots there, I think. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. Um, let's just leave. My carry weight is a little bit high now, but that's mostly because of the water I'm carrying, and I don't really want to leave it here. I can always drop it somewhere along the way. Um, I really do want to 
get some traveling done. This is the best time of day to travel. We're actually warming up with this porch right now. And we still have most of the afternoon left. Well, it took me long enough, but we finally made it out. And as long as I got my directions correct, this should take us to Mountain Town, which is another one of the beginner zones with, um, all right, so there's, we came from there. Trying not to get lost in here. It looks like this is just a dead end, though. Keeping an eye out for coal, although maybe it doesn't spawn in this uh, cave. Oh, there's a piece. Alright, well that makes me much more comfortable about any fuel problems I might have been concerned about. Alright, let's go ahead and get a fresh torch. a campfire with no charcoal. This is a really long cave system here. Okay, this looks like another dead end. Grab this coal. I'm perhaps being a little bit too thorough and cautious here, but I really don't want to miss any items in here. Okay, it looks like we've made it to the exit. Um, let's see if I can save this flame I've got going. I see over here. Okay, so we're above a river, and it looks like that's a road with maybe an orange truck down there. I don't want to step any further because I don't want to fall. And we're next to a waterfall here. Um, I need to keep a very close eye on exactly where I am. Actually, we are... This is probably a bad idea, but I'm up high above this area. I'm going to see if I can stand right here. Let's see what happens if I try to survey. Thirsty. Okay, we stayed pretty warm, but we opened up a bunch of... Oh, my torch went out. Of course it did. Alright, well, I should have thought about that, but... Um, the sun's not out, so... I can't 
relight a fire for free. Just go drink water so I don't have to hear about it. Alright, that would have been fine if I had just um, lit a fresh torch before I did that, but I wasn't thinking about how long it would take to do the burping. Tails. What is that? I guess that's just a weird particle effect with the wind. Or maybe there's water there. That looks that looks almost um oh, okay, it is from the water. The neat effect. All right, we're traveling into the wind now. This almost looks like one of those climbing spots where you can deploy a rope. All right, our porch was about to get blown out by this wind anyway. Okay, I'm a little worried about this. It is very cold. My concern is that if we don't find a shelter, we have to go all the way back to the cave, and then in order to sleep, we have to go all the way back to the cave, back to the Trapper's Homestead. So... below me there. I'm actually wondering if I can uh, shimmy down this instead of doing this big climb over here. to make a decision here. Um, if I climb down here, I'm committed. I think I'm going to commit. Because I can't climb back up without energy, and I can't get energy if I don't have a place to sleep. So I'm committing to finding a place to sleep. This is supposed to be one of the easier regions, but that's not really that comforting. Alright, we have a sign. That's a really good sign. I wonder if it says anything. Just something about climbing. Alright, so we have the climbing sign, the climbing rope, and that's how we get back to Mystery Lake. like... Whoa. Oh my gosh, that's a wolf. Is he chasing me? I think he's actually chasing me. I don't have a flare or anything. I think my best chance is to get in here and try to start a fire. Start it. Oh my gosh, I'm dead. There's no way I can... Oh, he left. Wow, that's lucky. Alright, let's get a fire going. Uh, match. Gotta be smart about this. Let's do the torch. I don't want to waste all my matches. Oh, I thought I was dead for sure. 
Lit Torch, Cattail Head, Book. Let's do it. I don't think I'm bleeding. I thought for sure that was the end of the I'm run right fire. there. And it might still be. I didn't see the wolf. I thought he was like a rock or so I don't know what, but. And I'm warming up. Let's see if I have, oh, I have all that coal. So I'll just throw one piece of that on there. I will keep my fire going for a while. Check my. So I didn't get myself into trouble as far as I think I might end up leaving some stuff here. Hope nobody needs this anymore. More matches. I'm really happy about that after the ones that I wasted. We will see. get this fire nice and warm. Okay. So now I'm warming up as fast as I can, I think. So I'm not going to be able to carry a torch with me. I think the plan here is to um, get some of that tea made. Go ahead and eat food so I don't have to think about it for a while. I can alleviate my sprain risk by leaving some of this water in this cave here. Warming up nicely. Stand right over here and drop some stuff. So water. And I'll leave some coal here. Eight minutes, I'll, um, what's the wind like out here? I'll grab a torch just to see, but it's probably gonna go out. Let's see, five minutes. Let's go ahead and, I wanted to leave a note about this. Yeah, it's way too windy for a torch. From Mountain Town to Mystery Lake. Water, coral, firewood. Okay. Let's take this. It's probably going to go out immediately. Yep. Alright, there's that wolf over there. So we're gonna head this way. I'm not stopping for anything. My um, ability to run is extremely limited. I'm running out of energy. If I don't get into town soon, then... There's 
a rabbit. Let's chase him in the direction I'm going. Climbing area to the right. I don't understand where I'm supposed to go. This all just looks like a drop-off. I guess I need to get over here to the edge and see what we have. Oh my goodness, what a mess. Is there a way down? There's a rope over there that I could climb up. But I can't climb up right now. Unless I have to. Do I have to climb up? Maybe I missed an entrance down here that hopefully doesn't require climbing. So as I look at this climbing sign, it's the climbing area on the right that leads me up to... my trail? Well, that looks like a drop-off. Let me see what I can see out here. So, there's a huge area there. I thought this was supposed to be a beginner's end. I think I got myself killed by coming down here. Like, I'm in good condition in almost every way. But without being able to go back up that climb... And now I've got a wolf on me. Um, let me think. I can actually start a fire. Now that the wind has uh, died down. I'm wondering if there's any way I could get to an inaccessible location. Oh, he went after a rabbit. Thank goodness. Okay, maybe there's a path over this way. That's the way I came from. That's the rope I came down. I still haven't looked out over there, necessarily. I think we might be worming our way down there. Let me just get up here and see what's... Um... Yeah, I just... I can't go back up. What am I even looking at? There's supposed to be a town here. Is there a structure there? Is this even part of the zone? If I go over the edge, am I just done? Jesus, it's cold! I 
I mean, I guess in theory I could try to climb up a rope right now. It does look like there's stuff over there. I think there's a good chance that my run ends here because I don't know... I wasn't prepared for the zone transitions and so I didn't actually know where I needed to head. Unless there's a way... Let me look at this sign again. Do I get my home warm up soon? Climbing area. I've been inside that cave. The sun is setting. A lot further soon. I came down this road. So one option is to attempt to climb that rope with no energy. That likely leads to death. I don't think it's possible, or at least it's very unlikely for me to make that climb. That's the branch that I came down before. So yeah, there's just nothing back here. So I think I either have to attempt to shimmy down in that one spot or attempt to climb one of these two ropes to get out of here. I don't think there's a way to leave this area outside of climbing those ropes. And since that might not even be part of the zone, and I might just um, lose automatically if I go down that side, I think I'm going to go over here and attempt to climb my way back out. Okay, I came up with an idea. I still might be able to salvage this. Am I warming up back here? Now. Fifteen sticks and five cloth. I have seven cloth and fourteen sticks. Let me go grab a stick. I think I can actually sleep in a snow shelter, even without a bedroll. There's a wolf over here again now. And the aurora has started, which means that the wolves are going to be powered up. I can't break that down for sticks. And I don't think I left any sticks here. I can harvest a torch for a stick. This episode is going quite long. 
Um, but we'll know soon whether Come on, I've been successful. Fire. to waste as little of my fuel as possible because I'm going to need it for um, in order to sleep through the night I think but I'm going to sacrifice this uh, piece of cedar to keep this thing going while I figure out what to do here oh I'm not actually warm use one of my pieces of coal. I really need all of this coal to be able to sleep through the night, but I also um, can't afford to freeze to death right now. This is rough. Um, I don't know where my torches are. Got a bunch of them. All right, the lowest one is 14%. Harvest it in two minutes. Now, let me just see where it's going to allow me to place this thing. I want to be as close to this cave as possible. And then I can potentially still have my fire in here. That's so going to let me put it there. Um, now, if I try to... Okay, I'm already cold over there. So I need to move my fire first. so that it's facing this way. Come on, little fire. The contrast between the extremely tense, life-threatening situation that I'm in and the peaceful aurora music is uh, pretty hilarious. All right, this is my permanent fire. Let's just throw everything on it. Except for the sticks, the sticks I need. Um, any other little bits of fuel here? Go ahead and grab all of this. Now, what condition is that birch bark tea in that I made? Is that still hot?
Did I already drink it? Birchbark tea, that's warm. Actually, it doesn't matter if it's warm because I'm gonna be right here in the, um, next to the fire, staying warm. All right, let's see if I can live long enough to uh, craft this thing. Let me get it as close to the fire as I can. What does it say? Um, let me actually try this again. I think it told me how to rotate it. Rotate is, okay, Q and E, or the mouse wheel. So let's try a couple of different orientations here. Come on, I know there's a spot right around here that I can put it in. Saw it turn green briefly before. Uh, now it doesn't want to. Alright, so it looks like I have to put it out there. I hope that's close enough to the fire. 45 minutes. It is very late. I'm about to get in here and see if this will work. This could be it. Let's do it. Can't tell. Let's see what the feels like says. Feels like 47, so I think I'm in range of my fire. Well, that's a really good sign. not really familiar with the controls. I never use this. I guess I can rest now because I'm inside here. Alright. I hope that this will work. My fire went out. Wow. I'm actually still warm. How is that possible? Where? I can't feel my feet. It's so confusing. I made it. Um, I think that was a save point. So we'll deal with all these problems that are showing up in the next episode. Um, somehow we're still alive, so new episodes will be coming out every day. Thanks for watching. Freezing. <laughs>